In prep school, I think we're one of the closest models to you know, the, the college hockey development model right now. Um, you know, we have the weight room in the fall. We play a, a college-oriented schedule where we're playing two to three games a week. Um, but I think our kids are, are combining education, hockey, and also becoming good people. You know, they come out and they're, they're ready for college hockey. They know what the schedule's like. They can mix school. They can mix, uh, you know, social life, uh, you know, with how to deal with girls and drugs and alcohol, things like that, in a, in a very... Um, you know, kind of supportive environment. You know, a lot of these schools for over 100 years have been uh, educating kids and sending them on the college. And now I think we've done a good job of uh, adding the hockey piece to it. I, I would go online. I would go tour the school, and I would get in touch with the coach, um, and also find a school that that fits your needs. I mean, some kids that are a little more academic should be looking at school A. Some kids that are maybe are in the middle should be looking at school B. Uh, there's schools with you know large populations, schools with small. Uh, there's co-ed schools and single sex schools. Um, and I think the one thing that you know Kent has to offer is we're you know, we're a very homey school, and we definitely are like like a lot of these other boarding schools looking out for the kid. I mean, if you send your 15, 16 year old kid away. Um, like I said, for over 100 years, these schools have been, been doing this and, and doing it very well. Yeah, I think, you know, we're obviously very proud of the, the hockey that, you know, the hockey players that uh, these, these, these prep schools have produced. Um, you know, I think the one thing that we're most proud of is, you know, not only Division One hockey players, but we're producing Division Three hockey players. We provide options for these kids. You know, say something happens, they break their leg, they get a concussion. You know, it's just like college. These kids are, you know, well connected for a good alumni base, and they have a very solid base, uh, you know, to go to college, whether it involves hockey or not. Uh, obviously, our number one job is, as a hockey program is to hope these, you know, these kids are ready to go um, for, uh, you know, college hockey. And, you know, our weight programs, uh, you know, a lot of these schools have, have private tutors and one-on-one -on -one help for these kids. So these guys are ready to go when it comes time to drop the puck in college hockey.